welcome to the next save Lego station. This time I have a old spooky hand from Holland. Uh, actually, it's a Green King. Uh, crafted fine ale, five percent ABV. And what they say? Once it's named not to a bird, but to a car, a paint spotted featherweight fabric saloon. Back in the day, this was the MG factory run around, fondly referred to as the old speckled un. Due to its uh, mottled appearance, after several years parked under the paint shop. The beer itself was first brewed in 1979 to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the iconic factory. Old speckled hen. Right, so they didn't add anything on the label for the Halloween. Just they changed the name and that's it, right? So it's a limited edition bottle, but they were not bothered to say anything spooky there. Why? It's easily done. They made the effort to, to you know, produce a special label, right? Right, okay. So we have old speckled hen <coughs> dressed for Halloween. Uh, crown. Just a uh, Morland's typical uh, brown uh, cup. Let's open it. Uh, quite nice. Typical clear bottle for uh, um, drinking. Alright, so what we have? Nice amber color beer, clear, small head, um, medium bubbles, it's disappearing quite quickly, looks like, yeah. Aroma actually is quite rich, uh, lots of toffee, yeah, definitely toffee, uh, maltiness. Uh, red fruits um, makes impression of the sweetness because of the toffee aroma. Yeah, definitely. Okay, let's have a try. Quite high carbonation, so I don't know why there's no head on it. it should be huge. <laughs> Nice full bodied beer. Maltiness. A sweet. Mm, sweet fruits. Uh, a little bit of honey. Um, breadiness. Some uh, burnt notes as well. Hoppiness, uh, quite nice, typical British one. So it's a little bit grassy, a little bit herbal, maybe a little bit earthy on the end as well. Some citrusy accents. Yeah, so it's refreshing enough. It's not very heavy, very drinkable because of this. Uh, I would not say it's sessionable, right? But it's drinkable really nicely. Uh, so, nice beer. Uh, my wife likes it. <laughs> um, full of flavor. Bitterness, it's not terrifying, it's on moderate um, level. 
yeah and it's like addition addition to flavors um, in beer right it's not contrast it's addition everything is nicely balanced nicely mixed uh, so it's lovely beer and there's nothing spooky in it uh, right maybe just a uh, you know lack of head uh, but it's okay it's okay Oh, licorice. Now it's licorice. And like I said, it's very rich in, in, in aromas and flavor. Uh, yeah, I would recommend this beer to, to everyone to check it out. Uh, it's good. It's really good. Yeah. I like it. Uh, they could make a little bit more efforts, you know, to change the story on the, on the back label. <laughs> you know, it's the same story as on Speckled Hand, hand so they could do something better. They made a special advertisement for this beer, you know, for Halloween. So, you know, a few lines of text, they could add it easily, really. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed this beer. Please like it. Please subscribe my channel. And if you are subscribing, please hit the bell button. It's important. It will remind you about every new video on the channel. So you will be up to date. Cheers.